they're all working up. Not all of them, but they're all coming for that wall. Let's go, guys. Holy shit. Oh god, this hole is way too big. Oh shit! They've got me through! No! Oh god. Hey, look! Crap, rip! Rip! Rip this colony. Or not. Oh my god! Oh my god, was this close or what? Yes, tell me what to do. Okay. Alright. Sure. <laughs> well, like I said. Like I said. This game can definitely be hard at times. Alright. This game can definitely be hard. <coughs> <coughs> I am excited about this game. This game is great. It's hard, but great. Alright, I think the gates require an upgrade as well. Alright, it's time for Project Executor. Every freaking... Wall should have his own executor. Also, weapons and it's RTS. Yeah, exactly. Oh wait, we wanted engineering center first. Do we want engineering center first? I mean, I guess. There's a lot of stone involved, though. Maybe we should get the advanced quarry and upgrade our stone quarries. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. We're getting into the... Ooh, crap. Territory. Like, we're... we're Always not going to survive sort of territory. Attention. Building completed. <coughs> nope. I keep clicking the wrong engineering. Yeah, let, let's get executors first or executors first. On all the walls that are now the outer walls. They're freakishly expensive, but... They will have to do. Iron and oil. Oh, we've got enough of that. So this is the executor, executor, it's basically got a big minigun on top of the tower and uh, it's good. <laughs> 
It's it's pretty good. It's a good tower. Building completed. And it's definitely one we need. So we need a heck of a lot of stone production in order to pay for all of them. Can't wait to see it in action. It looks pretty cool. I'll tell you that. It looks pretty cool. Nice! Forest blocking up this whole section. Unfortunately, even though it's a nice it looks it's a nice area to expand to, it doesn't have iron. Yeah! Serious atmosphere indeed. Trying to break through. That's pretty cool. Oh, a mini horde. Well, due to the surface area of coverage, they won't get through. I imagine. They are attacking the colony defenses. Our defenses are being attacked. Right between the eyes. Let me put an arrow in his head. They are trying to break through. Alright, this side of the map is pretty cleared out. Straight to the heart. The walls are under attack. They're still under attack. Oh crap! Okay. This looks way more serious. They are attacking the colony defenses. Lovely death. Are you my mind? What's up? Any infected around? Oh yeah, they're around. They're right here. Aren't there other units to bother? My phone is ready. That was close. Now we can't build a wall there because there are enemies there. Let's see. Ah, iron and stone. Green screen ain't work. Oh god. No. <laughs> that green screen. Hey, Devon. How are you doing? How's life? I thought the light would That's fix the green the screen, but I guess not. I will kill our enemies. Yeah. What is the problem? What is the I problem? It looks a bit weird. Haha! That was light. Yes. Yes. That's such a kill. And then there was light. I think this is better, right guys? At least on OBS it looks better. Light in the darkness of zombie terror, yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Alright. You've expanded enough. Let's or moved enough. Let's see if we can continue project executor. Executioner. There we go. And we can place another one! Nice. And we can place another one! Nice. Mama Astral Fish to the rescue, indeed. Alright.
Need a tent. So we could get some workers. So we could get some food going. No, that's not ideal. Because we want an executor there. I keep calling them executors even though they're executors, I think. I, I'm not sure. I have to pronounce, them, pronounce their name. Yeah, you can place it there. You can walk through the fields. This is your first game? Uh, it's my second. It's my second. My first colony uh, was pretty much rip. At the end. What day the horde will come? Uh, I believe it's two days before the end, so that should be 118. I think my previous game was 150 days and they it came at day 130. No, that's 10 days, so having 120 days it should be at day 110, I guess. I don't know. I have no idea. I need energy. What's up? Any infected around? I guess it's day 100 and... Because it's day 120, so I guess it's day 110. One would imagine. Yes, tell me what to kill. <clears throat> There's a worker shortage once again. So much space required. Attention. Building completed. For workers. Never mind the clearing. Approaching from the south. All right, this is going to be a rough one. Attention. Building completed. This is going to be a rough one. Because if they're coming from here. You know what I'm going to do? From the south, yeah, if, if they're going through the choke, we should be good, but if not, then we have a problem. There we go. It seems it's gonna be this wall, I think. I think it's gonna be this wall. Just in case it is going to be. Here we go. I'm getting an executor. It's gonna be this joke, it's gonna be crap. I need to kill something. I think it's gonna be this wall. Yes, so oh god, there's definitely going to be a mini horde on the choke. Is the choke. And 
it's gonna be that joke. Oh my god. Okay, we're screwed. We are so screwed. We are so screwed! We are so screwed. <laughs> no! They are trying to break into the building. Fall back. Fall back. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Told you this was a rough game. Oh shit. Oh my god. They are infecting our buildings. Oh my god. They are trying to break through. They got me. Oh, this side too. Well, Yes, I need you. Shit. Holy shit! The circlings have arrived! Yeah, for sure. I mean, the executor is definitely offering resistance, but. Yeah, this is so rip. The backing of game! Oh, come on. Yeah. It's Iron Man mode anyway. Our colony is succumbing to the infection. Our defenses are being attacked. Come on. Kill the zombies over there. They are trying to break through. Holy shit on this side as well. Crap. Holy crap! The infection is spreading across the colony. Well! I will kill our enemies! They are attacking the colony defense. Let's get them! Here we go! They're spreading to the colony from inside out. survived but <laughs> yeah like I said Zier like I said don't get yourself lulled into a full sense of security the later waves of this game are insane they are trying to break through the walls are under attack Glad they got stuck. Oh crap. Attacking the colony defense yourselves. 
Alright, the main ward is dead, but... Yeah, this is... Final horde will spawn the colony. I don't think we even get to the final horde. Pretty much. We are not even gonna get there. This is... Oh, great. Oh, great. <laughs> yeah, rip. Uh, rip. We got through. We're not even getting to the final ward. Hey, Rin. How are you doing? How is life? I'm doing good. I mean, not in the game, but in real life, sure. <laughs> in the game, we're pretty much screwed. They are trying to break through. Yeah, our colony is somewhat saved, but nice thing is that you can reclaim fallen buildings. Yeah, but this this is like unredeemable, pretty much. I mean, this is pretty unwinnable situation for sure. We've got too many gaps in the defenses now. And it will cost us too much resources to reclaim the entirety of the colony. So there's no way we can basically be victorious on the final wave. It's what it comes down to. Spirits are high, nice. <laughs> the meds. <laughs> Great idea, sir. What kind of meds are you taking? Do I even want to know? <laughs> Nice save though, right guys? I mean, we're doomed anyway, but still. What, do you, what did you think of this save? A reserve for the Harry Potter dinner, who knows? I haven't eaten yet. Ooh! Can you recover? No, is here. No, we cannot. Because this repairing will take way too much gold and stuff and time and basically everything that we don't have. That's what it comes down to. Or maybe we should not save the entirety of the colony and just dig in for the final bit. <clears throat> I don't know. Having 
fried toast and cheese. Feeling very German. I don't know if that's a German thing. I have no idea. Like we can repair everything, but will that solve our problems basically? All it comes down to. Because by the time we've repaired everything. I need to explode this car. I'm assuming the horde comes along and just wrecks us. Yep, like I said, like I said, this is, this is not going to work at all, like, we can forget it. Sauerkraut and Broadwurst as a dinner? Oh, right, as a dinner, yeah, no, wait. I thought you were talking breakfast for some reason. As a dinner, yeah, Sauerkraut and Broadwurst, for sure. Yeah, this horde is gonna rip into us like no other. Pretty much destroy the colony. Bam! Oh, we had a nice ride though. Why is the game not zooming out? Right, there we go. I am trying to break through. Oh man. Yeah, rip us. Holy shit. Well, it was a nice run, you guys. Oh my god. Yeah. It was a good run, though. <laughs> There's no way we could survive this after what happened. Our buildings are being attacked. It looks terrifying, yeah it does. Oh man! 87 days! And this is... Difficulty 22%. Difficulty 22%. And you have to complete maps. In order to unlock the other maps, you have to complete maps in 100% difficulty. So more than double this difficulty is what you need to do maps in. Holy shit. <laughs> this, this game requires some mastery of strategy though. Man. But yeah. They didn't reach the billions. We've got 4,000 infected killed. Hey Slinky, thank you so much for the GG. As you can see, I'm not an expert at this game. 
22 percent um let's recap what went wrong there I think we were expanding I think we weren't expanding fast enough I think that's the we could have expanded faster because we did have areas of clear map for the taking um, after having um, cleared out hordes we had like big wide areas for the map we, we cleared out a horde and then moved on with our uh, soldiers towards another part of the map and I think I am thinking too much about the final horde where all the zombies on the map get activated and I think at the start we shouldn't think about the final horde but we should think about just expanding and then immediately taking that area and building the buildings <coughs> oh no oh no the wandering camera <clears throat> Wait, is it still on the... Oh, I can't see it if I put myself in front of it. Ah, I want to see. Hold on. No, wait. We should be good. No, we should be good. Yeah. Hmm. But yeah, I think the lesson I learned from this is the moment you take a bit of area, take it. Don't, don't just go in there clear out the horde and then move on just go in there clear out the horde take the area and then move on expand faster because um because faster expansion means more resources means um you know quicker tech up to executors which i think is what you need and also um getting tech up quickly so we can actually get the engineering uh, the engineering center and start playing around with the robots and stuff <coughs> I think that's what it comes down to I think that's what it comes down to is faster expansion Yeah, next month the game will still be there and it will also be in early access. Um, I think they are going for a late 2018 release. So they, they said, uh, well, they didn't say it specifically, but what they, what they went for, I think in their, um, um, how do you say that? In their words, I think they went for a year of early access. They didn't say a year specifically, but from the uh, things that I read, I extra extrapolated uh, that they were probably going for a year of early access. So I think late 2018 should be when this game releases. And this game is also getting a story campaign, which is, re which is what I'm really looking forward to because survival mode is nice and everything. But like the story campaign, hmm, seems like a good one. Oh, the campaign is spring 2018. No, oh, I don't know if early access is 2018 then. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to that campaign. Oh man. Well, shit. There you go, here are my scores. Ooh, I did beat my score. I did beat my own score, there is that. <laughs> Look at that. But that's probably because of the uh, increased difficulty factor that makes it easier to beat your own score, I guess. Progress! Yeah. I can't really compare the two games because the reason, um, the reason I can't compare the two games is because I played one campaign the first day, my very first colony. I played it on... Um, 
150 days, and I played this one on 120 days. So you can't really compare those two games, I think. Like, I could say I reached this day, I reached day 87, and I reached day 130 with um, the first day. But those two can't really compare because I played 150 days versus 120 days to survive, so you can't really compare them. But yeah. That was Day of Billions. Alright. Or I should say this is They Are Billions. It's a great game. It's really fun. I do enjoy it. Ah. And I, I want to win this at some point. They Are Billions plus 100 now because they infected your villages as well. Yeah, it's, that's what they do, right? They like infected the buildings and then your buildings in your colony spawn more zombies. That's that's what they do. Which sucks. <laughs> But yeah, that is They Are Billions. Um, Alright, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for coming along and watching. Um, I will be back on Wednesday? I will be back on Wednesday for sure, but I don't know if it's going to be on this channel or on Book's channel. Um, Book and I are busy playing a Divinity 2 original Sin playthrough that's over here. For those who haven't clicked their name, clicked her name and followed, that's where we're doing the Divinity original Sin playthrough. Uh, original Sin 2, I'm sorry. I should pronounce the title uh, in its fullest. It's Divinity original Sin 2. That's what Bookfish and I are doing over at her channel. Uh, usually on Wednesday evenings, but uh, because of the dog, I don't know if it's going to be a thing. But um, expect a stream on Wednesday evening anyway. Either Book and I are playing Divinity on her channel, or I will be playing solo something else on my channel. Um, so expect a stream on Wednesday, uh, either or, either way. Uh, yeah, that was a shout out. That was a shout out, of course, of course. Um, because. Oh, you have no sound? Well, no matter. It's either going to be Bookfish and me on Bookfish35 or me myself solo on this channel. So on Wednesday evening, 8 pm Central European, check out uh, both channels uh, just to see what's what. Or my Twitter. Which is easier, <laughs> which I always announce stuff. Um, also, to look a bit more into the future, you guys, um, I will have a holiday. I have one last week of work where I will stream on Wednesday. And then after the last week of work, I will have a holiday. So I will be streaming my butt off because I need to finish Dark Souls. I want to stream this game some more. I want to play some Starcraft. Uh, wanna do all the stuff, so, um, yeah, that's all going to happen in the holiday. So expect more Astral streams near the end of the year and in the first week of January. Um, but yeah, I've been playing a lot of SC2 as well, SC2 too, uh, because I want that war chest stuff. <clears throat> um... But yeah, thank you all so much for watching and have a great rest of the day. And I will see you all on Wednesday, once again, either on this channel or over at Bookfishes. Peace! Have a good one, guys. <laughs>